This has all the telltale signs of a revenge bang. Katie Maloney's surprising Vanderpump Rules hookup is being revealed. During the Bravo series March 26th episode, Brock Davies reveals a secret about co-star Katie Maloney to her ex-husband Tom Schwartz. The revelation came about after the TomTom Tom co-owner admitted to kissing Brock's wife Sheena Shea years ago in Las Vegas while he was still dating Katie. We were partying the other night and Katie left with somebody in your friend group. And so oh, wait, I... wait, what? Yeah. I mean, who is it? It's a boy, bro. Max? Yeah. Max? Yeah. And she <laughs> best friend. Oh. Wait, she <laughs> him? Oh my god. Tom immediately guesses that the man in question is VPR alum Max Boyens, who left the series in 2020 after just one season. Yeah, this has all the telltale signs of a revenge bang. Okay, I didn't watch, I wasn't in the room. We sent a message, where are you at? His location was her house. Well, you didn't tell me that! And then he sent an emoji of a face, eyes, and a straight line. Oh, like, I, I f***ed up? As for how Brock knew about the alleged hookup, Sheena breaks down her investigating skills by saying this. At the Hotel Ziggy, we decided to go to an after party. Sheena invited Max, he rocked up, Katie was there, and throughout the night, we could see them getting close. And as we all start to leave, they kind of leave together. Later that night, I checked his location, and I see, huh, I don't think you live in the same building as Katie. But then the next morning, just out of curiosity, I checked it again, and he was still there. And it wasn't long until Brock confronted Katie about the hookup rumor in front of the cast that same night. So what, Max came over to my place afterwards? Yeah. Okay. You guys so just hung out, watched Netflix and chilled? So? What's the deal? There's no deal. I was just letting him know his best friend was at his ex boss house. Why does he need to know about it? Because you got his ass ran for keeping it in the friend group, but you went to his best friend. When I asked him, like... Three months into our separation, not to f***ing up Brown and this group, he did not give a single f about what I thought, so. Did they sleep together? I'm staying out of it, it's not my business. As for where Tom and Max stand today, the TomTom Tom co-owner says this on the March 26th episode of the Vanderpump Rules After Show. How did you approach Max after this? Like, did you, was there a phone call? Did he reach out to you or did you reach out to him? Um, he, actually, he actually called me, I think, like five days later. And said? And um, it, I could tell he felt so uncomfortable. I bet. But we went and got um, lunch in the Valley and, dude, I was like, I, he's like, dude, I'm so sorry. Like, literally f***ing alcohol. Like, just proximity. And I think Katie was, I, I'm not saying she was the aggressor. I think it was mutual, but, like, Katie was on, I think Katie was on a mission. Watch the drama unfold when Vanderpump Rules airs Tuesdays at 8 p.m. on Bravo.